again, I'm Adelaide, and if you're new here, I would really super duper appreciate it if you could subscribe to my channel. It would mean a super super lot to me. You don't have to absolutely no pressure. We talk about ADHD, autism, recovery from anorexia, vlogs, creative stuff, all the good stuff. I promise it's all good stuff. I super promise. It is my ADHD morning routine. If you didn't know what ADHD means, it stands for autism and ADHD. I'm diagnosed with both. Having ADHD means that I really struggle to keep routines, but being autistic means that I really, really need routine. And I have like a mini morning routine that isn't actually a routine, but it is a routine, if that makes sense. The first thing we do is make my bed. So we're gonna make my bed. And by make my bed, I mean throw everything on the floor. that my fan was on so i turned it off i have this issue where even if somebody made my bed for me and made it in the exact same way that i made it it would cause me so much anxiety and make me feel so uncomfortable i just have to undo it and remake it myself and it's not because they did it wrong but it's because they did it wrong <laughs> no it's just, it's just because i didn't do it and so it messes up my routine i have a coat hanger why it's falling off there I have this side sleeper pillow that I don't have in the case, don't judge me. Um, and it's meant to be like really puffy and good for side sleepers. And I'm that much of a side sleeper and a, well, I sleep like sometimes with my arm like this, um, but my pillow will be in between. So it's like this because I don't, I don't know. I don't know why. So now I've ruined, I'm, I'm too much of a side sleeper pillow scruncher that I ruined my side sleeper pillow. Then we go yellow. And then this side is higher, so I have my poo bears on this side. And then my ex little and froggy on the other side. And then we have a giant octopus, which just goes in the corner over here. Oh. And then we have zero in teddy form, which I sometimes like to like cuddle like this and sleep with. That was actually a Christmas gift off of some mum. But that's my bed made. And then I just kind of like tidy the room a little bit. So I'm gonna move the camera to a different angle over here so you can actually see what I do. My room isn't very messy, but it's just, my room is very small. And so it clutters really easily. So you'll see. This was washing that I was supposed to put away yesterday. These are the socks from last night. I have this box of clothes that I need to take to the charity shop today as well. Okay, so yes, I do do this most mornings. Um, not every single morning, but like, I, I make my bed every single morning, but I don't always do like a quick spruce. I, as long as my bed is made, I'm kind of happy, but I'm feeling like I want to do everything today. So I made this. Isn't it the cutest little mini rug ever in the whole entire world? We are just gonna ignore that my drawer doesn't have a drawer. It's fine, we don't need to get into that. These are baby clothes for my brother. So my brother's having a baby. Um, when my brother was younger, he was obsessed with Jurassic Park. So I got this cute little Jurassic Park, look at that. And then it has matching <laughs> So I'm really excited to give them to my brother. If you wanna know how well recovery is going, I have a Mars wrapper in my bedside tub. So, well, would be the answer to that. So this is my bedside tub. Don't ask me why I rearrange this every morning. I just do. Do you guys want to see what is inside my bedside tub? Okay. So this is the little, my little bedside tub. I think it's really adorable. I like the colours. I think the colour's really cool. Paracetamol. More paracetamol. More paracetamol. I have the book that I'm currently reading, which is Fix the System, Not the Woman. I'm literally like 18 pages in, so it's still a new read. I also have my pyjamas for the next day. Some razors. Hair clips. I have my um, oxygen blood pressure, uh, oxygen like heart rate monitor thing. And then some like pin badges. Why do I have pin badges in there? Because I've just not found a place to put them yet. Where did I just put my pajamas? Here we go. Why I messed it up? A pen, my Apple Watch, which needs charging. I keep putting it in my bedside desk, my bedside tub to like remember to charge it and then just don't remember to charge it. Makeup wipes, headphones, a purse, a lollipop. What charger is this? What's this for? What does this charge? What does this charge? I don't know what this charge is. Summer. And then my hair brushes, but they belong in the living room. Normally I pick an outfit off of here to wear for the day, but because I didn't put my washing away yesterday, that's what I'm gonna wear today. So I'm gonna wear my Lucy and Yak. Oh wait, no, because I've gotta go to an appointment. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to wear a skirt today. So I'm just gonna put away my washing from yesterday. Bubbly jubbly. Yes, over here, my clothes do have an order. I've got Lazy Off, Monkey, Lucy and Yak. And then I have more t-shirts, which are from Monkey, so they'll go onto this side. And then we just do a little 
So it's a bit of freshener. It is Febreze Orange and Neroli. So that is my morning bedroom routine and then we're just gonna head into the kitchen. Anything that has been left from the night before, I'll then put away and I'll also put some music on, but I'm not gonna put music on right now because obviously I'm filming a YouTube video so I won't be able to have the music on. But just know that now I'm gonna put music on, do a little dance, which I might do later. And then I'll fill my washing machine, get my washing ready, and then we'll do the living room. We also feed the cat. I'm gonna speed this process up and I'm gonna put some music on. I'm so sorry, but I'm gonna tell you what I'm gonna do. So basically, I'm gonna move my camera all the way over here and I'm gonna tidy my kitchen, put my pots away, I'm gonna put my washing away and then I'm gonna do a little hoover. I don't always do this in the morning, especially if it's early because obviously my neighbors and I don't really wanna be like clanging about and stuff when it's early in the morning. But right now it's like half past 10. And so yeah, normally if I'm not able to do all of my actual things that I need to do in the morning. I will always wash my pots. That's the first thing I do and sweep the floor just because obviously I have a cat. But other than that, that would be it on a like on a day when I don't really wanna do everything else. Sometimes I don't do that. Sometimes if I'm having a really bad time, I'll just come in, make a brew and sit down. But I'm showing you on a good day. So this is my ADHD morning routine on a good day. But yeah, I'm gonna put some music on because I wanna dance and sing. So I'm gonna put this in a time lapse. Shitty car, but we hit the doesn't matter where we go and destination or no I don't care where the motor stops Cause when I want it, then I want it Yeah, I want it, oh I want it, let's go Look around, where's the people at? I want a taste of the good life Hit me with it right now, in it Cause when I want it, then I want it Yeah, I want it, oh I want it, let's go And I won't go back, yeah I don't care about the bad shit Okay, I've had to stop for a minute. It's literally been 10 minutes. I really haven't done all that much. Um, I've just like cleaned the kitchen and hoovered, but I've got a phone call in five minutes that I need to take. And then we'll see whether I continue cleaning or not because I need to, I'm gonna sit down and take a phone call. And I just, I also just wanna say that this is not every day. This is my morning routine today and some days of the week. And I have days when I literally don't do even two of the things Making my bed and washing my pots is the only thing I will always, always do. And if you want to see a morning routine on like a bad ADHD autistic day, then then let me know. You can hear my washing. I also did a washing. I'll be back when I've had my phone call. Maybe. We don't know. I had my phone call and I can't be bothered to continue to do any of my routine. So we're going to go on a little tour. I'm going to pause my washing machine because that's a little loud. Please remind me to press play again on that. Uh, but my kitchen is semi-tidy, I guess, I don't know, yeah, tidy, done, and then my living room, which is just this, my desk area, which I can't bother cleaning up right now, but I've just got, how cute is this mirror, all my art stuff, and then, yeah, that's it, all of the washing that was on the maiden is on my bed, uh, which I'll do later, I tell myself. The hardest part of my routine is having a shower and brushing my teeth and it is not because I'm dirty, not because I'm unhygienic, I just, I honestly don't know why, I just have to really really tell myself to do it and I, I do do it every day but it's the hardest part of my routine to do and it's the thing that I put off to do last and I wish that I wasn't like that but I am so I'm gonna go and shower and then I'm gonna do my makeup and get ready and then that is the end of my routine. I'll check back in when I've 
got my ready to enjoy my outfit and stuff because I'm obviously gonna look cute as heck. It has been like two days since I filmed the RDHD morning routine because I just literally like sat on my couch after I had a shower and then did not do anything with the rest of my day. I completely forgot to film and then I just haven't been doing anything. I've been really boring and just watching YouTube and stuff. Honestly, that's a little bit more accurate <laughs> for an RDHD person's morning routine. But today I feel like I look super cute. I've got like green eyeshadow on with like little white daisies and stuff and then like little blue flowers. And then just some Lucy and Yaks and a little jumper. But yeah, I'm gonna go out, I'm gonna go and get a donut and a coffee, I'm gonna go say hi to my friend Jack. I hope everyone has a super, super good day, and I'll see you next time. Bye!